Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Sorry, back to my channel. I had to do it. I had to do it. Well, I am so excited for today's video. It has been a month since this was ordered and it has been very difficult for me to restrain myself and not watch other people's videos on this. So not gonna lie, but this is exciting. The energy that I am currently experiencing is beyond anything else. But we are unboxing Jeffree Star Mystery Boxes! <laughs> get excited, get excited, get excited. So I have ordered this July like 10th or 11th. Today is like August 7th or 8th. I don't even know. Um, and we are going to be unboxing these are beautiful, massive box. Now, just for like size comparison, if I like curled myself into a ball, I'd probably fit. Yeah, it's big. It's big. It's a big box. So I thought I'd unbox it. I kind of want to do a quick little like predictions of what I think I'm going to get in here. I've got a premium mystery box, a deluxe mystery box, and a supreme mystery box. I didn't bother with the mini one because I was like, I don't like four. Pro it's only four products and it's cheap, but like converted to Australian dollars is not cheap. I thought I'd do little mini predictions of what is going to be inside the box before I do any opening. Like it is completely sealed. Like nothing is gonna. Like yeah, nothing's gonna. It is sealed. But my predictions. Obviously, I know roughly how much and what is inside of the boxes, which I'm actually gonna quickly bring that up on my laptop just for background reference. The mini box which I didn't purchase was. 25 US dollars, everything's in US dollars, with a $64 value, it was, then you had the premium box, which was $60, and this was the value of $115, then you had the deluxe, which was $100, and had a value of $183, $183, and then the supreme, which was $180, but had a value of $323, so I bought the supreme, the deluxe, and the premium, so that's exciting, obviously with this one as well, you had... We had, he had the, the like the giveaway, the pink ticket giveaway, so it'd be pretty awesome if I was to get one. Definitely don't think I would, but if I did, this is a live reaction. I've not seen what's inside, so this is going to be interesting. But I'm definitely keeping my hopes up to have at least, apart from the Star Ranch, which he obviously told everyone was in those three boxes. Apart from having those. So I definitely expect, apart from Star Ranch, at least another two palettes. Now, I don't have a lot of his palettes. I'm praying jawbreakers in this more than anything. I've wanted jawbreakers for the longest, longest time. Um, and I definitely think there's going to be a lot of liquid lips, obviously, just by previous and at least one highlighter. So I'm thinking minimum of two eyeshadow palettes, one highlighter at least, and a lot of liquid lips. And I'm hoping for at least two lip scrubs. Or like, actually, let's be realistic, one lip scrub. I really want a lip scrub. I've never had his lip scrubs. My hair's a bit of a mess. My nails are horrible. But like, let's get into this. So we are doing this. We are going to unbox this. We are, let's just get excited for this because it's a big one. If this mystery box is the best thing ever, yes, I will buy more because this is my first set of mystery boxes. I can see there's pink tissue paper inside because the sticky tape got caught in the pink tissue paper. Yeah, there's pink tissue paper. There's, I can't see what's inside. But yeah, um, I'm definitely excited. If this is a good box, it will pretty much determine if I buy more boxes in future but if this is a shit box then or well, these boxes are shit then it'll probably be me just buying one in future and not the entire or like a lot of the boxes so you guys are gonna get a sneak peek i can't really see this is what it's looking like right now a lot of pink tissue paper okay when you take that out I can't even get this in the screen because it's so big and I'm going to fall off and I'm the, yeah. So you can kind of see, there is three here. Hold on a minute. Is that three? Yeah, it'll be on, it's just one. Okay, so we have, this is the card. This is on top. This is for the Supreme Glosses. I'd love to see you. I'd love to have one. And it's all the nude ones on the, on the back. Sorry, my ring line. But it would be nice if this was like a gift, like a hint of like we're going to get one. If we do, I'm excited because I've, again, not tried his, a lot of his products. But you can see there are three mystery boxes. You've got the little packing slip, which is obviously what you bought. Um, for reference, I got the Supreme in a small, which says SM. So I'm not sure if it's like a small medium, but it's definitely meant to be a small. Um, 
so yeah that's what I got okay I kind of want to do it in order of like smallest to biggest because I want to be most surprised so the smallest box is okay much smaller than I expected <laughs> I thought this would be like the mini what color is the mini is the mini blue does it say it does say premium on it yeah no mini is like a teal this is this is the premium okay so this is $60 and this is meant to have six items so I'm just gonna put this aside for a second in front of me they're just sitting there and we're gonna open this I'm honestly not gonna edit a lot of this so we're at 11 minutes um yeah sorry I'm I just want to give you guys my honest raw reactions without feeling like sh like I don't want to edit too much and it looks really like fake because this is for my first mystery box and this is ex this is expensive. <laughs> this was not cheap. Okay, I need to cut a little bit more. My scissors are also kind of dodgy right now, so I apologize. They just don't work the best. Okay, I'm scared. I can't see. I'm covering my face. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes. I don't know how to open this. Fudge. I can't open. Is something sticky tape still? Oh shit, dumbass, it's a lift. Okay, hold on, ready, ready? You guys are getting a preview. Okay, I can't, I've, I'm, I've got my eyes shut so I can't see anything. Okay, lifting, I don't even know if it's in the frame. Okay. It's pretty color. <laughs> okay, wait, are we ready? Are we ready? I see a lot of pink, I see a lot of pink. I see a lot of pink. Okay. I see a lot of pink. <laughs> okay, I see a lot of pink. So the first thing I see is the gloss. I've never had a gloss. Okay. This is exciting. This is in the color silk rope. Okay, I want I'm oh my god. I'm seeing a lot of pink and I, I love pink. Pink's my favorite color. Pink, pink. I don't you can't tell, but I've got a lot of pink everywhere. Okay, I love this is a nice color. Okay, this is already giving me really good vibes. Oh, this is a nice color. This packaging though, what the hell? Okay, I want to smell it. This, I love this. This lid is just iconic. I'm sorry. He, Jeffree Star is iconic. I don't care what you think. He's amazing, I think, in my opinion. Oh, this is nice. This smells really good. It gives me like vanilla, but like caramely vibes. Vanilla caramel. I swear I have. I've smelt this scent somewhere in a candle. Okay, this is exciting. Oh my god. Okay, this is really exciting. The gloss. Part of the. This is part of the orgy collection. Now, one of my friends actually was like, "I really hope you get the orgy palette." So, if I was to get the orgy palette, which is was it was actually I, I'm talking so fast, I'm so excited. Which I believe was actually in the spring mystery boxes. Um, I don't necessarily expect it to be in these ones because I'm like. You know, it doesn't always happen. Like, you don't always get doubles of things. So, that's exciting. The gloss. Okay, next is a lip scrub. Yes, it's a velour lip scrub. I did say I wanted at least one, so we've got our one. And this one is in Rainbow Sherbet. Oh, this is exciting. I was hoping to get something a bit different, not like blue raspberry or like strawberry. Because, like, obviously, I know what they smell like. But I've never had one. I'm going to say I did not expect them to be this big. So I'm very pleasantly surprised by the size. I love the chrome color. I think it's really pretty. Okay, first impressions, we're gonna smell. Oh, it's green, okay. I didn't expect it to be green. I thought maybe like pink. Oh, <gasps> yeah. That sm straight up smells like lollies. Like straight up smells like lollies. That just gives me like childhood vibes. <laughs> I think I know what the exclusive product is in here because I don't think I've ever seen it, but we're gonna leave it for, for a moment. We next thing on my eyes goes to are the eyes, uh, eyeshadows. So of course this is this one was meant to have. Let's just quickly hold up this product. This box has six items. So we've already looked at two. This is three, four, five. So clearly they count this as one, maybe. Hold on. How? Okay, if they were to count this as one, one, two, three, four, five. I still only have five. Unless did I drop something? Okay, so this is really interesting. So it says six. So does, but I have three of these. So does that mean I'm missing a product, or does that mean they count like this is one and this is another, and then the other product? Because this is meant to have six products. It says contains six, 
And I technically, and in future boxes, he only counted these as one, like as a set of threes counted as one and everything else, with, which means I'd only have five of six. So I'll have to definitely double check that. But let's actually look at these. I haven't even looked at the shades. Okay, so we have three singles. We've got orange juice. That's just cute. Raspberry, ooh, and priceless. Okay, let's quickly have a look. I honestly don't know where they would come from, like what eyeshadow palette, because I'm assuming they would come from palettes. I think a lot of these singles are from palettes, so you can mix and match and create your own. But this looks really good. Ooh, that's a nice color. That's nice. That's really pretty. Orange juice. Okay, guys, I'm really like, I'm actually kind of like scared that I'm missing a product. And if I am, I will be complaining because it took a freaking month to get here. I will be a Karen, okay? I'll be Karen's daughter. My mom's not a Karen for reference. She's quite nice and quite chill about things. Okay, raspberry cake. I feel like these would probably come from like, um, the, what's it called? The blood money. Not blood money. Oh my God, blood sugar. That's really pretty. Raspberry. I like that. But I don't think raspberry is in it. I don't remember seeing that shade name. In it. Okay, this is really exciting to see such a pink box. Like, I really like the fact that this is so pink. And then the last shade that's single is called Priceless, which looks like it's just a nude kind of color. Oh, it's like a peachy kind of peachy color. Sorry, my nails are horrid. I'm sorry. Oh, this is exciting. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to go next to this because I think this is probably the exclusive because I've never seen this. But this is a tinted lip balm in cowboy kiss it's brown so i'm scared it's going to be a brown lip balm and i know in his pink collection that he did with the pink religion they did this lip balm oh my god this oh, this is beautiful i'm sorry take a close-up look that is beautiful this is heavy like i love lip balm but this is bloody heavy this could do some damage okay oh my god it's straight up brown okay it smells nice that's a straight up brown that does not look like it's going to be a lip balm i'm sorry that looks like a lipstick but it's called Cowboy Kiss. I'm assuming this is the exclusive because I've never seen this. A soft, innocent touch of color, hydrating, silky, necessary. Bring your lips back to life with their tinted lip balms. Okay, this definitely has to be exciting. Um, yeah, wow. I feel like, I, I definitely feel like I'm missing something. So I'm gonna have to watch people's react, other unboxings and see how they've counted things. Because, like, technically, if you count them individually, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But it says it only contains six. So that's really weird. I'm like, the box is empty. <laughs> I've taken the last product out, which I'm assuming is Star Rand, packed all nicely. And I am so excited. Okay, I don't want to rip it. I really don't want to rip the sticker. So I'm just trying to, like, light. Yep, no, we've ripped the sticker. Okay, we've ripped it. Okay. First impressions. Obviously, I've seen the packaging. And sadly, I have seen the interior. Oh, I did not expect it to have... Can you hear that? I did not expect it to have this, like, feeling. That is gorgeous. Okay. This is so exciting to me. Because this is the palette he is going to be releasing, he said, in his video. But he's not releasing it for several more months. Okay, how cute. Okay, sorry. Let's connect. If you've not seen this, don't know where you are but like this is definitely neutral and wearable he did say it's wearable i don't necessarily say that that the blues here are wearable but i do think it's a more wearable palette than let's say jawbreaker mini that's just this is exciting okay i've just taken the film off but like that's pretty i must say i'm really excited for the blue winter creek which is like that like navy glittery blue it is sparkly if you couldn't tell um but i'm very excited for it i'm here for this Yak Farm is calling my name as well, and Casper Mountain, I'm guessing I'm TN, old Jeff, <laughs> that's cute, the names are really cute, okay, definitely excited, it's a good box, I have to say, if I only had purchased this, I would be pleasantly, I'd be pleasantly happy and like, satisfied with what I'd actually purchased, because like, nothing here is something that I wouldn't wear, the lip balm, obviously I'd have to swatch it, but I'm not going to swatch it right now, because lipsticks and i want to put it on my lips so i might actually do like a first impression of trying on out some of these products in a future video but like nothing here is like so unwearable that you would want to like you'd want to sell it kind of thing or give it away because you don't like i'm pleasantly happy i'm just going to put this in the background so you might be able to see it i'm sorry i'm just going to put this tissue paper on the floor because there's so much of it right now it's everywhere 
Okay, so next is the yellow box, which is the deluxe. This one's meant to contain eight products and was $100. How bloody cute. This one, yes, deluxe. Another thing I'm really scared about is something being broken and like having to complain and be like, by the way, I got my mystery boxes. I waited a month, but like it came broken. Like I really don't want to have to complain. I don't think so because he packages his eyeshadows as you saw. They had bubble wrap very well. So, okay. So I'm just going to cut this. And again, I'm going to do the same thing where I'm going to open it in front and close my eyes and show you guys what I got. And like we're already kind of kind of hit like some marks like i said i wanted at least one lip scrub we've already got one um if i got if i get more oh my god i just broke my scissors i literally just broke my scissors oh my god live reaction i broke my scissors i need new scissors badly okay i might have to like yell to my mother and be like mom give me a box cut out of scissors because yep I, I just broke that yep that's not weird okay we're gonna try and be careful with this i've had these scissors since, since i was in primary school and i've like really trashed them break anything and I don't want to check the inside so I'm trying to be really careful because we've got these and I'm not going downstairs right now and I can't really call my mother okay so we're just gonna kind of be careful with that <laughs> that's embarrassing okay eyes closed can you see can you, you can kind of see okay more tissue paper obviously as per always with these mystery boxes okay hold on I'm like I, I can't uh, okay, hold on. Let me just try and move some of that. Okay, that looks like I removed the entire top. Ah! Shit, this shit is moving. Okay, I can't see anything, but it's moving. Okay. Okay, are we ready? Are we ready? Are we ready? Okay. Okay, this is good. This is exciting. It's yellow. Yellow paper. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to grab the first thing I saw, which is another tinted lip balm in Bloodstain. I'm... Am I crazy in thinking that this is not the exclusive? Because now we've got two. <laughs> I'm going to cry something else and he just... It's just... Oh my god. Okay. Bloodstain. Or is this meant to be like a sneak peek of new product a new product launch he's going to be doing? Because he's been releasing a lot of lip balms. Like he's done the lip, glitter lip balms and he did the uh, Shane Dawson lip balm. I don't have that one. Okay. Again, really cute packaging. I'm assuming this is going to be like a red. Oh, yeah. Not really. They kind of have a really faint smell, but it's it's a red. That looks really pretty, actually. I'd probably wear this one more than Cowboy Kiss, but that's exciting. Okay. I'm scared I'd tip something out with the paper. No, no, I didn't. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's exciting. Okay, that's one. So this is meant to have eight. So the next product is... Another Velour Lip Scrub. Ooh, pink grapefruit. Okay, so we've already got two. This is exciting. Okay, we've got two now. And there's other things in here that I actually want to cry about because there's like an inside joke with someone that I don't know. I'm no longer friends with, but it's always been something I've wanted from Jeffrey, but never purchased. Okay, pink grapefruit. But I'm so, I'm, I, so yeah, I'm really happy that this box has it. Like, this box has already made it just for that. Like, yeah okay it's pink this isn't oh that's nice that definitely straight up smells like pink grapefruit pink grapefruit is not my favorite fruit to eat or to like drink in a juice but i do like the scent like i can appreciate the scent it's really nice okay so we've got two that's two next thing we have is another of the gloss in part of the orgy collection again this is tabletop um it looks like a more brown nude rather than um what we just had which was like a more peak like a straight up like gray nude kind of thing okay oh this is like a darker color this is a much darker sparkly version can you see that's you can't really see the sparkles but like that's really pretty okay that's i like this one better already and again yeah nice nice scent okay this is so exciting i don't know maybe i just get excited by makeup way too easily <laughs> i feel like i do i'm not gonna lie so that's three Okay, I'm guessing this is they're counting these as four. So we've got another three single eyeshadows. You guys can get to see the colors before I do. So we have the colors Intravenous. I'm guessing it's how you say it. I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Then we have Flourishing. I love the word Flourishing. And the shade O Positive. So I'm, I feel like O Positive is in Blood Sugar. Is it? Okay, so O Positive is what we're going to show first. So that's already six single eyeshadows. We've got a palette here. We've almost got an entire palette. Okay, that's a nice color. Oh, I can't even hold it. 
that's a nice color it's like a brownie red kind of thing it's cute I like, like, not even brownie like gray red kind of if that makes sense i swear my color description but like the way i describe a color is just weird sometimes <gasps> yeah flourishing is gorgeous i love that that's a beautiful teal blue that's gorgeous what's the exclusive product in here because i know there's meant to be an exclusive the last shade is intravenous i don't even know i'm gonna also do like a quick calculation of what the box was worth okay that's cute. yeah it's just like a brown that's nice that's pretty and neutral I like that this palette like this box so far with what we've received is also again something that i'd be really happy with obviously i don't i haven't shown you everything that's in here but i haven't seen with everything in here the next thing is what made me want to cry and then like when i looked down and looked up and i was really excited it's of a low liquid lip and it's in the shade calabasas now i'm going to just share the story because i think it's kind of cute there was a friend of mine and when this came and like came was released i remember when it was released i was watching the video the youtube video and he was kind of like launching it and i was i was on the phone with a friend and then i showed the person and they straight away read it as calabalasis and it just stuck so i always wanted it and i always would be like oh i really want to get calabalasis and it that's that's how, what I, that's how i call it calabalasis not calabasas which is clearly what the, it says but calabalasis and I, I i literally i can't read the word calabasas without thinking calabalasis so it's a weird thing but i showed them the color and the name and that's how they read it out loud and i was on the phone and this is a absolutely stunning rosy neutral color so again like i was really scared of getting like green liquid lip now the next thing looks like a makeup bag this thing oh my god is it no, it's not. It's not a makeup bag. <gasps> okay, I think I saw another exclusive. Okay, this is not a makeup bag, clearly. This is like a bum bag, a, a blood money side bag. Okay. Okay, I want to open it because like, I don't know. I've never had one of these. I don't know what this even is. This low-key feels really massive. Is that like the correct word to use? I don't even know. Okay. Everything obviously is tea leather. But okay, it doesn't have like a bad smell. It just has like a scent. Okay, so I'm assuming this is kind of... I'm going to check the inside in case he put something on the side. No, he hasn't. Oh, that's cute. I've, re I've never really seen the, like the little detail that of, like the stuff that says Jeffree Star. That's like metal. A metal? Wow. A metal, Olivia. A metal. Nice zip. It's very... It's like a nice like feeling. I was scared that I was going to get everything from like Blood Money and green everything. I'm Green not my favorite eyeshadow. I, I do like green, don't get me wrong, but I prefer like pinks. But yeah, very cute. I'm not going to take this out because I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this yet because I don't think I'll ever use it, I'll be honest. But it's like a crocodile kind of print. It's cute. I think if you're someone who loves collecting Jeffrey products, you'd like that. Okay, so recap, the bag, the gloss, the liquid lip, the lip scrub, that's four, five. I'm guessing this is six because if this is containing eight products, there's two more in here. This, I'm assuming, is the exclusive because I've never seen this. I couldn't even tell you what it is. I think it's a, it's a, like, it's an eyeshadow, it's a mag magnetic palette for your shadows. So I already have six, so I'm pretty much already filled this. So that's pretty cool. That it honestly does look like that's what it is. A magnetic palette. So I'm excited. That's cool. Okay, so I'm guessing the two exclusives with a palette and the lip balm because they're the only two new products unless like the lip scrubs new but i doubt it and of course because everyone was told another star ranch i'm gonna leave it like this because i already i've shown you guys what it looks like but another one okay so that was one two three four five six seven eight yeah so they've counted all three as one so now i'm confused how did they count premium because if they count all three as one like they always have I'm missing one. I'm missing a product. So I, I'm gonna have to clarify that. Okay, so yeah, again, recap. That was a hundred dollars and had the va apparently the value of a hundred and eighty-three. Not bad. I definitely would say that if I got that again, I'd be happy. The only thing I don't like is the bag. Only because it's green. If it was black, I think I'd probably like it more, or if it was even red or pink. 
but it's just the color green green's not my favorite color and dark green like that again not my favorite but we've got one more box this one's supposed to have 13 items it was 180 the most expensive and this will have apparel in it it's smaller than i expected i thought this would be bigger I'm not gonna lie i'm just gonna double check the massive box okay this one doesn't have anything it's going on the floor sorry if you hit thud there you go okay so this just has the apparel i obviously got it in the small so i'm excited and nervous i'm excited because i don't really know what's going to be in here but i don't have any eyeshadow palettes and like that's what made the spring mystery boxes so good the fact that there were so many eyeshadow palettes so i'm like kind of upset that i don't have one so i'm hoping i'm hoping there's one in here so let's let's pray pray for me because i really want one and i haven't gotten a highlighter and i haven't got as many lips as i expected not gonna lie i thought i'd get more liquid lips or line lip liners or something but this again has 13 products and no pink ticket yet guys so i didn't think so but we're gonna open this up again I'm scared okay what is that that's a straight up yellow box that's a hand mirror. I don't have any hand mirrors. This is exciting. Okay, so you take that off and it's all red in the inside. We're going to just see this. I think this is the pink sickle. Okay, so this was unfortunately spoiled on Instagram for me a couple of days ago because Jeffree Star Cosmetics decided to post and say that this was one of the exclusive products. So I knew this was going to come and I'm really excited to touch it, like to hold it because I've never held one of his mirrors. I've never had one. I've never really thought of buying one, really, because I have my big makeup mirror. I don't need it. How do you open this, though? I've cut it, and I can't really get to it. If you've not seen the Instagram yet, then you haven't seen this. But holy goodness, that is gorgeous! <laughs> How can you? I love it because it's pink. I'm happy it's pink and it's not a green lip. Like, this is really nice. I've never had one, obviously, you can kind of see what I'm at, but that is a gorgeous pink. And I love the fact that it's nude and pink and white. <laughs> I just look too exciting. Okay, that's product one, clearly. So there's 12 more. Okay, so because this has all got a paper, I'm going to just... Obviously, I've seen the paper. Okay, there's a lot of paper. Okay, I really can't see other than the fact that it's purple. Okay, okay. Oh, I'm gonna click the, cl the box close. I don't wanna see what's inside. So that's your shirt. I'm guessing it's, it's a t-shirt. Um, I kind of was hoping for a hoodie, not gonna lie. But I do know that it's summer and hoodies are a bit weird. But I'm also in winter. So like realistically, this is not gonna get worn much. Oh my God, it's not even a, it's not even a shirt. It's like a, a muscle tee. I'm wearing this as a bloody dress. This looks massive. This looks massive. I'm wearing this as a dress. <laughs> I've already said it. I should have bought a medium and that would have been a full on dress. It's pink and purple, which I like. So that's cute. Didn't expect this. I expected like a bigger product. Not going to lie. But it's cute. It's cute. So that's product two. I'm going to put these here. I'm going to just keep my eyes shut because I know I, I, you can see what else is in here. And I'm nervous. Okay, I'm holding each art wing down. Okay, can you see? Can you see? Ow, money. Okay. 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 Interesting, interesting. So I have the ball. <laughs> Is that what you... It's the beach ball. It's the Jeffree Star beach ball. He was selling these. It's so cute. It's much bigger than I expected. I don't go to the beach often, so... But this is really cute. <laughs> that's really cute. I wasn't expecting a beach ball, but okay, that's product three. So we've got ten more to go. Okay, just by seeing, like, I can just tell you, like, there's some good things and some things I wish I didn't get. Not gonna lie. But only because it's it's scaring me. It's green. It's green. I'm gonna go to the green thing first. It is massive. This is the Supreme Frost, or the Extreme Frost, sorry. Um, the highlighting powder. These are so cute, the cases. Okay. It's, it looks green. I'm sorry. It's like a gold green. I hope it's more gold than green. This is stripper magic. Okay. Okay, it doesn't smell like anything. Stripper magic. It kind of looks wearable. Okay, I kind of, I need to see a swatch of this. I'm not going to swatch it now. 
Oh, this that's a nice closure. Okay, but okay. It's not as bad as I expected it to be. I low-key thought it would be like a highlight, a green highlight, a straight up green highlight. Okay, that's cute though. We got another magnetic palette. So that's product five. We have another star ranch, that's product six. Again, I've shown you so you know what it looks like. I'm gonna grab the three single eyeshadows because we've got a whole palette now at this point. We've got Mint Condition, Bite Me, and What? So I'm gonna go with Mint Condition. Um, I'm only disappointed, okay. The only reason I'm disappointed, that's cute, that's pretty. The only reason I'm disappointed is because spring boxes were pretty awesome, I'm not gonna lie, like they were like palette after palette after palette, like people were just getting palettes. And it obviously makes what you purchased a lot more worth it. I'm not saying that getting a lot of lip products and getting what I've got isn't worth it. I just think, like, when you see so many other ones and then you get, like, you don't get that, it kind of gets disappointing. But I'm okay. Like, it's, it's, I'm happy. That's really pretty also. Purples and pinks are my favourites for my eyes. Okay. And what is probably my favourite out of these three. But that's exciting. Okay, so if we count these as one, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven products, which is not bad. We're not done. There's quite a lot still left. I'm going to grab this because it's a different colour. It's a Supreme Gloss, full pigment gloss. How exciting. And my mum has just put a, no a note under my door. Okay, so this is in Blow My Candles. So the, the card was a hint that we were going to get one. So that's pretty good. Okay, I don't know what this colour looks like. I've seen all his videos. I watch all his videos as soon as they get released. Okay, so I think it's a nude. It is. Okay, good. It is a nude. Good. I'm happy. It's Oh, we're just dropping things. I'm happy it's a nude and not like something like a green, like I said. Okay, this is cute. This is a pretty colour. Ooh. That's, a, that's the best scent that I've smelt today. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. And I like the lid, how that's like um, raised. Like, that's cute. I like that. Next, we're going to go for the Cremated Gloss Collection. This is in Heaven's Gate. I feel like the, uh, people have had this colour in mystery boxes before. I'm not sure, but it does. It rings a lot of bells right now. Okay, I'm scared. It's like a silver. Okay, it's a silver. Oh, it's not that silver. It's like a white. It's like a silvery white. That's that's wearable. I'm quite happy that the lip products have been wearable and haven't been green. Because if I honestly, if I got green or blue, I probably would have been like, what the actual F? We have a okay, that's an exclusive. Okay, I want to do that one last. So we have another lip scrub, the low lip scrub, and this is in candy necklace. So I said I wanted at least one. I've gotten three, one in each box. I wonder what the mini had. So this is, again, the Velour Lip Scrub in Candy Necklace. I'm hoping this is pink. Is it pink? Is it pink? Is it pink? Oh, it's not pink. It's like purpley. That's cute. Oh, that's the best scent. That's the best scent. Yep, yeah, that's the best scent. That straight up smells like bubblegum to me. And I love bubblegum and fairy floss. Yep, yeah, that's, 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 that is the best scent. I'm sorry. What product are we up to now? One, two, three. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're at ten. Yeah, okay, 13. Yeah, it's 13. The next product is a lip liner in Dominatrix. Dominatrix is one of his, like, iconic colours, I feel like. I don't have any lip liners. This is the first lip liner, which is pretty good. Okay, that's exciting. I definitely think I'm going to be getting more mystery boxes in future. But it's like a brownie red. It looks brown. Okay. I don't know why, but I expected these to be more wooden, if that makes sense. But they're not. They're more like that creamy crayon-y one. And again, no sense, which is good. But yeah, lip liners, they're exciting to get. So I'm going to do the exclusive. This, I'm guessing, is called Yak, maybe, because of the animal. Because that's it's a yak farm that she hit, that he's living on. Um, it looks like a brownie red, based off the picture. So we're going to open. I'm going to, like, close my eyes. Would I like it? Tell me. Yes! Oh my god, that is gorgeous. That is, that's really pretty. That's a, that's a shade that I would probably go reach for very often. That is stunning. Okay, I'm very I'm very happy. And last but not least, the one palette I probably wouldn't have wanted in these mystery boxes, not gonna lie. I was but I had a feeling I was gonna get. Blood money. 
Like, you already know when you get the dollar bills, it's going to be blood money. You don't even have to check the inside. But I'm not going to... I'm not saying that I... Do, I okay. Yeah, this is, this is bloody beautiful. This is bloody beautiful. I'm not saying that I'm disappointed because I didn't... Like, I don't like the palette or I don't like the concept. I love blood money. I think it's really... I, I really like it for a green eyeshadow palette. I think it's quite nice. And I like how his palettes work. That is beautiful. But I'm really also glad that I have zero double ups. Like zero. Like nothing I've gotten today, I already had. And I know I don't have that big of a collection. Okay, that's cute. Okay, I didn't realize you don't get to, you don't have to push both. You only push one. You can hold the other, but you push one and ta-da. Oh yeah. Okay, I can't be disappointed. These are actually really pretty shades. Like, that's really stunning. Heavy weighted chocolate, chocolate, Chocolate tears, Olivia. It's crocodile tears. It shows you that I'm hungry. Um, divine intervention. These are really pretty. Money highest. Oh, I bloody love that show. And season five's coming out soon, so I'm excited. CEO. Yep, yeah, that should be me. Self made. Yep. Yeah, private island persuasion. This is really pretty. Black card limit. Oh, lovely. Okay, so yeah, these shades are really pretty. I don't think they're, they're the most wearable. They're not going to be the most wearable. Like you're not going to grab this palette for an everyday basis. Let's be real. Oh, you could. You could, but I don't think you would necessarily i wouldn't personally it is really pretty though i'm gonna be honest it's really pretty and it's really clever and i like the closure and i keep the unicart the unicartness and the packaging so i'm i'm that person who appreciates it that is everything that is exactly 13 products so the only thing i'm concerned about is in the premium box and like if the three eyeshadows counted as one then I'm missing a product. Overall, I am so excited and very happy with everything I've gotten. I'm going to do some quick calculations and tell you guys how much everything cost and then let you know if it's actually more than the value that was actually that was estimated or it was meant to have or if it's less. This is really good. I was really scared because thumbnails were like not worth it kind of thing. Like they were just looking like angry. I am extremely happy. Yep, I'm very happy. I couldn't be more happy, I don't think. Actually, I could. If I got to a break, I probably would have been, like, ecstatic over the moon. But, okay, I'm gonna go. Hey, guys, and I am back. I did it by calculations. I didn't change I didn't change them into Australian dollars. I thought I'd just do that live here with you guys. Um, but I've watched two, just, just two YouTube videos of people unboxing their boxes. And it actually definitely does look like I am missing an item in this box. I did the calculations, I wrote them all down. So, just to recap again, the premium, which is the blue box, the little one we did first, was worth, or well, I had paid for it $60 and was meant to have a $115 value. Now, with everything I have currently, these are normally $12, the lip gloss is $18, the three eyeshadows, these are $9.99 each, so three of them is about $29.97 if you wanna be specific. And the Star Ranch palette, if he goes based off all his mini palettes like Mini Jawbreaker and the um, Mini Conspiracy, they're $28. Um, and the lip balm, just based on these other lip balms, they're all 18 as well. So that was a value of $105.97. So I'm definitely missing a product. I'm having a really hard time trying to value how much this is. I'm not sure if it's $20 or if it's like $10 or if it's $15. I really don't know. I'm assuming it's probably about $10, $15. $10 to $20 is probably like the range it would be. It would not be any more than $20. Bucks. If it's $20, bucks, even like US, it's like kind of a lot still for one of these. Um, so I am curious to know. Okay, let's just go to the deluxe, which was the yellow box that I've got here. The Star Ranch again was $28. Lip scrubs are $12. The lip gloss, the glosses, which are these kind of the gloss, they're $18. The eyeshadow is $29.97. Lip Quid Lip is $18. The lip balm is $18. And the bag is $50. Now, I saw one of the other mystery box openings and her bag was a nice black and white makeup bag, not a green crocodile bag. So that kind of annoys me, the fact that I got that. Yeah, sadly, that totals $173.97 and it's meant to have a $183 value. So that to me kind of tells me that the palette's about $10, roughly. So that kind of does make sense that it's $10 for this box and it's $10 for the other box. But it doesn't make sense for the, for the Supreme box. The Supreme had the lip scrub, 
which was 12, the lip liner, which was 16, the Supreme Gloss, which was 20, the Blood Money Palette, which is 52, the Three Shadows, which is 29.97, the Gloss, which was 18, Liquid Light Lip was 18, Supreme Frost, they're 50, that's insane. The Magnetic Palette, which we're not going to count yet right now. The ball, the other beach ball is $10, so I'm assuming this one was $10. The shirt is $18. And then the mirror was 30 if we go based off all these other popsicle mirrors. So that's 12. And then 13 would be the um, palette. So without the palette, this is not including this as a $10. That was $301.97, where it's meant to have a value of $323. It seems like this is $20. And if it's actually $20, then all my other boxes are extra like they're valued extra but if they're meant to be more like 10 15 dollars like technically that's what they are for these other two boxes ten dollars then i should like they should have given us something else <laughs> that's what i think they should give us another, like another eyeshadow or something to make up for the value but i'm not mad like realistically i'm not mad i think the boxes were worth it um i do think that they could have been a little better with more eyeshadows because the spring boxes knocked it out of the park based off of the previous boxes they had a lot of eyeshadow palettes and i guess that they did because they all had a star ranch but it's just a little disappointing not getting another palette other than the blood money because yes technically i have four eyeshadow palettes and nine eyeshadow singles which is technically another palette like size wise but it's just a little disappointing because people were getting like two of these kind of thing in their boxes. I'm definitely really happy with everything. I think the Star Ranch is actually kind of is really cute. Not gonna lie, I really like it. Um, and I'm excited that I have products like the Supreme Gloss, um, the gloss, the normal, like all these glosses. I'm happy to get the lip scrubs. I've never tried them. Um, these are all products that I don't have, so I'm really happy to get. Um, like the Extreme Frost. I do want to see this swatched because I'm kind of scared. But I don't really feel like there's anything here that I'm like, oh, other than maybe the bag, because, but that's just because I know I'm never going to use the bag. Um, personally, I just, the colour is just not me. Um, that's the only reason I wouldn't keep it. But other than that, like, I really don't think I'd sell anything. Like, everything's quite pretty. It's They're quite wearable shades. Like, the glosses, like, it's not a clear gloss, but, like, I'd still wear that. But, like, that's a gloss that I would wear. The, lip, the liquid lips, again, they're all still colours I would wear. So overall, I'm quite happy. Are they worth it? Yes. But if you want to spend your money out of the three boxes, if you were like on a budget, I'd probably say get the premium, the pre which is the blue box. Be buying more boxes in future. I've decided. I will. I will. Although this was meant to be a birthday gift to myself. Um, because I did buy it in the month of July and I always spoil myself in July. I was so scared I was going to get like the green liquid lip bundle or like the blue one. So I'm quite happy that these are all wearable things. Um, the only really weird thing would be the bag for me. Anyways, I think that is the end of the video. It's been a long one. It's been a fun one. It's been an exciting day. It's been, a, it's been good. So I'm happy. But yeah, I'm just like, holy shit, I have so much makeup. I don't even know where I'm going to fit it all. So... I'm excited. Stay tuned for future videos because 110% I will be getting more boxes and will be filming more videos like this. I will love you and leave you. Go live love and love. Bye guys.